wanna live my life I'd have done a lot of dirt, I earned my stripes Opposition snitching, talking on the phones, nigga Well, that put me and my brothers in the limelight Gangs involved in the latest conflict covering BC's Lower Mainland have been active for years. What's changed is that these gangs, particularly the Brothers Keepers and their enemies in the Kang group, are posting rap tracks online where they're attacking and insulting and taunting their rivals. These taunts are graphic and in some cases celebrate extreme violence. One such song contains a 911 call from a penthouse suite where Brothers Keepers founder, Govinder Graywall, was found murdered by his brother. Be warned, this call is disturbing to hear. Right. On the rain, so smoke on your OG. On your OG. Trying to put a BK on TV. On TV. Now it tells little ho come don't me. Now it tells little bro come link up. Bang. Leave a couple of them holes in his don't piece. Do. Send light to his head and his homie. Leave him dead like bro did his OG. Address is 1550 Fern Street. Dang, dang, dang. Okay, apartment 2502. 2502. Mm -hmm. Okay, reporting a gunshot wound, deceased patient. Hi, okay, so what's happening? Uh, I was to check up on my brother and then found out he's been shot. Found out he's what? He's been shot. He's been shot. Okay. Anybody else in the house apart from you? No. Okay, is there a gun there at all? No, there isn't. Okay, okay, is he cold or anything like that? Yeah, what's your brother's name? People participating in this rap battle are not big or recognizable names, but some do have associations with higher profile Toronto based rappers. Experts say the new development in BC with gang linked rappers releasing diss tracks online sounds similar to other major cities plagued with gang violence like Chicago and the south side of London and San Jose. Experts also say the results of releasing these songs could go in many directions. Either the release of the song could allow for those involved to blow off steam without resorting to violence, or the opposite could happen, where rivals feel compelled to act after being insulted in public online. That leaves law enforcement with the question of trying to separate fact from fiction, boasts from bloody confessions. Police in BC are starting to examine the origins of these songs. An investigation to how the 911 call was obtained is also underway.